incorporates hip hop, house, and soul with some traditional African sounds. Well, that's four member group, usual suspect. We hail from different parts of South Africa, from Kimberly to Mzanti, uh, whose names are Ash, Danny Ntlantla, and Sebe. Now, two of the uh, the band members, Sebe and Ash, join us now to tell us more about their album. Good morning, guys. Welcome to Morning Live. Morning. Live. Okay, yeah. let's establish, how did you guys meet? Who, who comes from where? How did you guys decide, okay, we're gonna form a foursome? Okay, well, basically we met uh, during a performance in Bloemfontein. Mm -hmm. uh, different individuals were performing different songs, so we liked the way each and everyone was performing, so mm -hmm. we decided to do a track. Mm -hmm. And then when we did the track, yeah, we performed it in Joburg, and then Toho Records caught up with us and decided to sign us, and then, yeah, that's how we met. Yeah, yeah we're from different cultures, backgrounds and places, Swaziland, Bloemfontein, Pretoria, and Val. Yeah. All right. Why the name Usual Suspects, though? Okay. How we came about the name Usual Suspects? You know, sometimes when you are artists, unsigned artists, but you're making it in that area that you stay in, I feel, I felt we were, we were already represented by ourselves already. So I felt if we chose the name Usual Suspects, it wouldn't be as usual for other people that would discover us in the long run when we move yeah. on. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, so you guys say you fuse together hip hop, soul, house, traditional African sounds. What does that mean? Like, what, what kind of sounds? Uh, how did you even arrive at this that we can mix all these four genres together? I think it's because we all have different tastes and we all have, we're from different cultures. Mm. So it makes sense that we incorporate different um, music and genres because it will work for the four of us. Mm. So in that way it makes everyone happy and we don't want to be usual. You yeah. understand? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so speak to us about who does what. There's Tlantla, uh, there's Danny, there's, then there's you, Ash, and then Sebe, but what, who does what in the group? No, okay, well Sebe is a vocalist. Mm -hmm. uh, Danny is a vocalist, Innocent is a vocalist, then a songwriter as well. I am a songwriter, I'm a <laughs> vocalist, I'm a rapper, I'm a producer. Yeah. Okay. How do you guys make sure that you guys are on the same page though? A group, uh, there's four creative minds, all thinking in different directions, but how do you make sure that everybody comes back, you're here and the focus is usual suspects and the album needs to be out? I think it's because we all know what we want mm. and as much as we family basically so you know in families you fight you argue but at the end of the day you all want the same thing so yeah if you all want the same thing then you work towards getting it yeah all right let's talk about the title of the album what is it titled and what's the significance of that title okay we we actually chose the title shang and way uh it's like we feel certain cultures are not expressed fully so how about we embrace each culture individually? Yeah. We're still gonna represent other cultures along the lines, you know, as time goes on. But this is this one was our favorite. Yeah. Because initially when we, when we did the song, it had a kind of groove, a shangan groove to it, yeah. that we kind of spiced things up with it. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that was the main inspiration behind it. What were the highlights of putting this album together? The best part of embarking on this journey. Here you are, you guys met in Bloom. You, you were singing it for different people. You've decided that you want to put all this talent in one pot. Okay, so we stop working on another. We've decided on a name. Then what? I think the highlight for me is getting to know different cultures and working with men. And I'm the only female. Yeah. So, yeah, it's actually awesome. And I learn a lot from the guys as much as they learn a lot from me. So, yeah. yeah. For you, what were the highlights of putting this album together? Uh, I mean, it was friendship for me yeah. as well. You know, as much as I do love music, but I love these guys. Yeah. You know? <laughs> that was one of my highlights. You, you don't know, have a when choice. You, when you meet people <laughs> along the road and they become your family, yeah. that's, that's the highlight for me. All right. And what makes you think the music industry is ready for your kind of sound? It's because we're not, we're bringing something new. You yeah, understand? We're not usual people mm. don't expect you to mix different genres of music so yeah that's basically it so yeah, but what it. makes you so confident that the industry is ready for you it, it all because it's it nice is. to be different yeah. but the music yeah. industry let's be realistic the industry okay. is very harsh right. you know and you can't always tell how your music is going to be released to be received i say uh you know what we've we've studied the way other people that are making it in the industry, how mm -hmm. they are doing the, the music, you know. 
even though we are different and coming up with a different style of approach, but we're still relevant mm -hmm. to, to what people listen to on a daily. All right. And who did you work with on the album? Producers and, you know, the other guys behind the scenes. Okay, we have our producer, Trix, mm -hmm. and Skeptic. Mm -hmm. Yeah, those are the two guys we currently working with. And why were they the best people to be part of this dream that is Usual Suspects? Uh, okay, it happened that uh, me and Trix were... He was actually my road DJ. Yeah. So when we bumped into Sewe and the rest of the members in Bloom, that's that's when it all happened. Yeah. And I decided to tag him along. And Skeptic is from Val, so mm -hmm. Ntlantla decided to tag him along as well. Yeah. And we were a unit from then. And that, it, it that's how it worked. Magic, yeah. Of yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, thank you so much for talking to us. Members mm -hmm. are for some usual suspects. Uh, Seb and Ash speaking to us about their album and music. They'll perform for us two more times on the program. Uh, so stay tuned to Morning Live. Let's take a night break. We talk all things ballet after this.